Getting breaking news that Amit Shah is meeting BJP National President Rajnath Singh at his residence in Delhi. This is the latest in the series of meetings that are underway in the capital as far as the Bharatiya Janata Party is concerned. Aditi Anant Narayanan is now joining us with more details on these hectic parlays that are on in the national capital. Aditi, Amit Shah after the RSS uh, top brass met uh, Rajnath Singh now comes up to the party president to meet him. What is on top of the agenda as far as Amit Shah is concerned? Maha, over the past one and a half hours, the RSS uh, leaders have been inside Party President Rajnath Singh's residence. About five minutes back, Amit Shah has also reached here. What we're getting to know is various discussions are being taken place inside Rajnath Singh's residence. The, on the top priority is the discussion on what exactly transpired in the meeting that took place yesterday in Gandhi Nagar in the presence of Narendra Modi. We are learning is that Rajnath Singh is giving notes, is explaining what exactly happened with Narendra Modi, what was the discussion that has been happening, backdoor meetings that have been happening with the BJP, BJP leaders over the past three days. In fact, uh, Nitin Gadkari has been playing the role of a moderator who is also a very close pracharak of the Sang Parivar. So everything together, everybody is taking notes as to where, what is happening. The RSS at this point of time is ensuring, Maha, that there is smooth functioning of the party and smooth sail when the party comes to power. Amit Shah has also reached here to get to know what exactly happened in Gandhinagar yesterday. He has been here since uh, the elections got over in Uttar Pradesh and okay. Amit Shah is getting equally uh, updated about what is happening with the BJP leaders. What did Narendra Modi say? What right. is in store for LK Adwani? What is in store for Sushma Swaraj? So all big decisions are being taken here at Rajnath Singh's residence and at Nitin Gadkari's residence before the final call is taken on Saturday during the parliamentary board meet, Maha. Aditi, help us understand what your sources are telling you about the advice that the RSS is giving as far as the seniors in the party go. Maha, the RS has made it has made it absolutely very clear that the BJP should not move ahead without getting all the top leaders, uh, the BJP leaders, especially those who were at one point of time displeased by the uh, by Narendra Modi. So that includes uh, Al Khairbani, that includes Murli Manohar Joshi and Sushma Swaraj. The RS has said that the final decision should be taken by the BJP top brass. However, the situation should not come that the BJP should face any sort of an embarrassment by these particular leaders. So the RSS has made it absolutely clear that if Narendra Modi wants to move ahead as the Prime Minister, he has to ensure that all the big leaders come into line, fall into line, they are on board. All the demands that are being made by the senior leaders as to what position they want after the party comes to power should be considered by Narendra Modi and all the leaders who will be taking the final call. So the RSS is saying the moderator here is playing the is giving the helping hand just to ensure that there is no infighting which becomes public yet again and they have sympathy towards all the senior leaders specifically Maha okay. to ensure that they are brought into place, they fall in line and they are not mipped yet again especially that we have seen a lot of uh, infighting coming out in public over the past few months. So this is something that RSS is ensuring that the party does not face again Maha. Aditya Narayan and many thanks for getting us all those details about the meeting that Amit Shah is now having with Rajnath Singh and the meeting of the RSS top brass with Rajnath Singh as well earlier on.